First news follow up this morning. The housing market is one of the many entities that have been affected by the pandemic, but different areas have all been affected differently. First news weekend morning anchor Connor Kick is live now in Boardman this morning explaining what local agents are seeing right now. Good morning, Connor. Good morning, Brandon. One thing that real estate agents here in the Valley are seeing it's houses flying off the market. Now, this is a story that we brought you about a couple months ago. And when we first talked to some of these real estate agents, they said that they were going to see exactly this. But right now, a few months into the pandemic, that's exactly what they're seeing. But here in Mahoning County this year compared to last year, the average amount of days that a house will sit on the housing market decreased by 4%. It does differ from school district to school district, but these houses are not sitting for long in any area. Jenna Coons, a real estate agent with Howard Hanna, was selling a ranch style home in Poland not too long ago. In 24 hours it, of it being on the market, they actually had over 38 showings and seven offers. Coons says that there are multiple reasons why we're seeing this, but a low inventory and high demand is the dominant driver in our market. We have buyers that are out in the marketplace looking for a year and a half to two years before they find the perfect home. So they're not putting their house on the market until they find the perfect home. So it's just been a lack of inventory. And then COVID kind of stalled things. And that stall affected their spring selling time, which is one of the busiest times of the year, but that has continued on into the latter stages of the summer. But coming up in our next half hour, I'll tell you about how close some of these agents are getting to the actual listing price and some issues that they're running into between buyers and sellers. Live in Boardman, Connor Cake, First News this morning.